a £1.2 million mansion that was disguised by a drug dealer to look like a farm shed is being converted into a six-bedroom family home after it was earmarked for demolition. Convicted drug dealer Alan Yeomans, 67, hid his seven-bedroomed house, Sheldy Manor, in Derbyshire, using green cladding to make it look like a cow shed. The cannabis grower told officials he was bankrupt and living in a shed in his mother's garden while claiming he had just £300 worth of furniture and a £30 watch to his name. Police later raided the hidden property in Yeaverley, near Ashbourne, following a tip-off to discover a mansion full of luxury goods, including a £10,000 Rolex watch and antiques, and oil paintings worth £83,250. Green cladding on the mansion is now being removed and the windows being installed to convert the house into a luxury family home. Yeomans was later jailed in 2016 for six and a half years after police found 40,000 worth of cannabis plants in a secret room behind an oil painting of an Elizabethan statesman, Robert Cecil. The 67-year-old admitted a string of offences, including fraud, money laundering and producing cannabis. He previously declared himself bankrupt in 1993 and 2009 and had used the green cladding to disguise his house and defy local planning restrictions. After he was jailed, the property was auctioned and initially earmarked for demolition, but later resold. The current owners have now been given planning permission by Derbyshire Dales District Council to renovate it. They have now been granted permission to remove the green cladding, put windows in rooms that had none and create a new entrance. Architect Matthew Montague said this property has quite a history. It was built to look, from the outside, like a nondescript corrugated green agricultural barn. But it was far from that, and in reality there was a luxury hidden within. Quite a considerable amount of work is now needed, both inside and out, to make it into a house, but permission has been granted so the owners can get on with it. Yeomans was jailed after pleading guilty to nine charges relating to the production and supply of cannabis, stealing electricity, concealing criminal property and failing to disclose bankruptcy. Derby Crown Court heard he had built the manor in 2002 in his mother's back garden without planning permission and with green cladding to disguise it as a large shed. Sentencing Yeomans to jail, Judge Nermal Shant said branded the 67-year-old a liar, a money launderer and someone involved in the production of drugs. Insolvency Service Investigator Glenn Wicks said, What surprised me when I went into Shedley Manor was that someone built a six-bedroom manor house in the Peak District and filled it with fine art and antiques and the authorities didn't know anything about it. This was a very intricate, sophisticated setup. Please like and comment, and I would love it if you could subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.